Hey Sagittarius, welcome to your reading. Sagittarius, thank you so much for joining me for a reading. If you are new, thank you so much for joining me. I hope, wow, I hope you subscribe and I hope you enjoy this reading, Sagittarius. And if you are returning, thank you so much for joining me once again. You have the Ace of Swords flying out. Sagittarius, I feel like lately you feel like you said all that you needed to, all that you need to say, all that you are going to say when it comes to a certain situation. Something has been, been made official, Sagittarius. Something has been made official for you. With this Ace of Swords flying out like that, Sagittarius, I'm getting that it's done. Something is done. The Page of Pentacles. You're looking at a situation in a different light, Sagittarius. Maybe you felt like something small. Look at that. And you have the sun at the bottom of the deck. Wow, Sagittarius. Look at that. Look at that. Oh. Sagittarius is beautiful. I see that you're you're looking at, at a situation in a different light. I feel like it's some type of offer that you're looking at in a different light. With the sun coming out, Sagittarius, it could definitely have to do with a, a romantic connection. With this page of pentacles it's like you're waiting you're waiting sagittarius to to see how something transforms it's like something is transforming right before your eyes sagittarius with this sun like the truth is being revealed about a situation you have a better understanding of a situation sagittarius and this is why you're able to move forward the way that you are sagittarius you're you're moving forward in a very mature way you're showing up as very brave, Sagittarius. Those around you see you as very brave, very strong, emotionally strong here. You could be support. Oh, wow. Look at that. With the Ace of Pentacles. You could be giving support to, to others at this time. Someone could be definitely uh, given given to you, Sagittarius. I feel like you're in a season of receiving of receiving a lot of love, a lot of admiration, especially with the sun and the chariot. Lots of admiration. Look at that with the King of Cups. Oh wow, yes. This is bringing you a lot of joy, like emotionally. It's like you're emotionally strong, but just because you're emotionally strong, Sagittarius, it doesn't mean that it's okay for you to be used and abused over and over again is what I'm hearing, Sagittarius. It's like you put a stop to that with this Ace of Swords. You put a stop to a certain cycle here. A certain cycle has ended, Sagittarius, for you. You're going towards, oh, wow, you're going towards a celebration. You're going towards freedom. Look at that with the Four of Wands, Sagittarius. It's like you're going to come a waters. It's like you're going where your love you definitely could be being celebrated soon. Some type of celebration. It's like you got your happily ever after. We have the Knight of Swords. You have someone coming coming in with a message. Someone will be bringing you a message, Sagittarius. This person could be attending the celebration. Could be a part of this celebration. These swords, you could be uh, connected to a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. All of these swords. Some type of communication is going in. Um, it's, it's coming in. Four of Pentacles. Someone is going to bring you some type of some type of idea, Sagittarius. But that is only after you have laid something to rest. You lay a particular situation to rest. Something was overwhelming for you, Sagittarius. I'm getting something was actually uncalled for. Let's clarify. Tell me more about the Ace of Swords for Sagittarius. Look at that. The Six of Wands. It's like you're you're moving forward, Sagittarius. You're moving forward and you're looking at something in such a, a different light. <laughs> Gonna have someone to reach out to you, Sagittarius. I 
hear I hear congratulations. I hear congratulations. Sagittarius. Wow. Look at that. They hire fun. I hear it. I hear it. I hear it. And I see uh congratulations coming in for you. Those around you really look up to you. Many, many view you as the higher fun. You could be very wise and knowledgeable. You could be sharing this, sharing this gift with others. Wow. Look at that. With the nine of cups. Yes, you're sharing this with others, uh, Sagittarius. That's why the sun is here. This is Leo energy. This is about you coming out. This is about not hiding. It's like you're balancing out a healthy ego. Wow. Wow, Sagittarius. It's like your cup run is over here. Tell me more about this chariot, the page of cups. You have someone joining you. Someone joining you in this happiness. Someone wants to be a part of this happiness that they see that you have, Sagittarius, because you persevered with the chariot. Oh, wow. Tell me more about the page of pentacles. I mean, the ace of pentacles. The six of swords. Because you know how to get shit done, Sagittarius. You know how to get shit done. So you have someone who's coming in who wants to connect with you. They admire you, this person. Tell me more about this King of Cups. Wow, you have the King of Cups sitting here. You're so happy. Oh, look at that. We have the lovers. You're so happy. You're moving forward in a love situation, Sagittarius. You're moving forward in a love situation. You decided something. You, you've you made up your mind and you're moving forward. You're moving towards a celebration. You're moving towards happiness, Sagittarius. Because this is what you deserve, Sagittarius. This is what you deserve. Someone knows that you deserve this as well. Someone knows. Look at that. And the sun coming out again. Someone knows. This is clear to see. The sun shines upon this love situation. The sun shines upon this romance, Sagittarius. You're getting so much love from your community, from your lover. Oh, wow. You got the four of pentacles. <laughs> this person could just want you all to themselves, Sagittarius. In this celebration. Wow, you have the four principles twice, the lover, I mean the sun twice. Wow, beautiful. Tell me more about the Knight of Swords. Someone has something they have to say. Look, they're talking to the chariot. <laughs> they're talking, they're they're definitely coming towards you, uh Sagittarius. You're you're definitely viewed as this chariot. And this is clear for others to see. This is very clear for others to see. Wow, Sagittarius, you've been there for someone. Tell me more about the four of swords. And you lay something to rest, the star. You're focused on the end goal. Like you don't have time to be playing no games, Sagittarius. You're focused on the end goal. Wow, beautiful. Look at that, the world. A new cycle has begun. And you know it, Sagittarius. You know this. You feel it in your soul that a new cycle has, has begun for you, Sagittarius. What does Sagittarius need to know about their love life at this time? Make the effort. Great love is worth taking the steps you're guided to take. I feel like you've definitely made up your mind about a love situation. If you've been, if you've been confused or if you've been indecisive about a love situation or about a connection, you've decided to... Make the effort towards that connection. It, it brings you a lot of happiness, a lot of stability here with the Ace of Pentacles. This is a major offer and you know it, Sagittarius. Let me pull one more. What else does Sagittarius need to know about their love life at this time? Soulmate. Yes, this is your soulmate. And I'm getting that a lot of you feel this. You feel this very strongly. You feel this very strongly. You feel like you are connected with your soulmate, with your twin flame. You feel like this person has, has taught you a lot of lessons, but at the same time, every lesson that they taught you ha has not been ugly is what I'm what I'm getting here with this nine of cups. Every every lesson that you've learned, you know, throughout this relationship or throughout this connection has not been in vain, Sagittarius. And you're realizing that. Give me one more. What does Sagittarius need to know about their love life at this time? 
worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. So I'm getting in the past, Sagittarius, you could have felt indecisive about a love situation because it just wasn't the right time, Sagittarius. It just wasn't the right time. You and this person that you were connected to or that you are connected to, you two were on two very different <laughs> wavelengths at, at one point. And I'm getting that there's some type of balance coming in for this connection for you, Sagittarius. I'm going to pull some energy for you. mistress people see you as very very mysterious Sagittarius you're admired you're admired by people that you don't even know who that admire you people know you that you don't know Sagittarius here you have obstacles there has definitely been an obstacle you have the chariot twice you ha you've had to overcome a major situation regarding your emotions regarding your stability here and in your love life there needed to be some type of balance some type of balance was achieved here you have oops and you have the evil eye oh wow Sagittarius so you're in this chariot energy you're being you're being offered a beautiful a beautiful love offer Sagittarius and I'm getting that there's someone around you or, or someone in your energy. And this person doesn't have, you don't have to actually spend time with this person or, or, or set of people. But Sagittarius, you, you could have someone giving you the evil eye. And I'm getting someone gave you the evil eye and they didn't really know who you were. But something is being revealed under with the sun here with the lovers. Something is being revealed. So I feel like who, whoever gave you this evil eye, who, whoever is giving you this evil eye, they're, they're in for a rude awakening because you're showing up as love, Sagittarius. You're showing up as the sun. You're showing up as the nine of cups. So someone was mistaken, Sagittarius. Someone basically had you messed up, Sagittarius, with the oops. They realized that they were giving the evil eye to the higher front. They were giving the evil eye to the chariot and to the king of cups. Someone who, who loves. This could have been an obstacle for you because some of you know about this. Some of you know about, about the bad energy and the bad juju being sent your way, Sagittarius. You could have been worrying about what, what people think. A lot of you are letting, letting that go and you're, you're allowing yourself to just be a mystery. Shit. If you don't know me, that's fine. It's like you don't have time to prove yourself. You're allowing you're allowing things to, to be a mystery. And that's what I'm saying with this with this ace of swords coming out first. It's like you're done talking. You are who you are. You can say what you want to say, but this is me. I'm showing up as love. I'm showing up as, as the sun. This is the real me, Sagittarius. This is what I'm hearing you you say, like in, in your heart. This is this is what you feel. This is me. And I I don't have time to explain myself because I've done that. You've explained yourself in the past here with this nine of swords. Let's clarify. Tell me more about the evil eye. Tell me more about the evil eye. The ten of wands. You don't have time to be worrying about who's giving you the evil eye. You're staying protected, Sagittarius. You're staying protected. It's like your focus is elsewhere. There's so much work that you feel like needs to be done that you don't have time to be wor worrying about things that you cannot change. And you cannot change to an extent, you know, what another person thinks of you. Regardless of what you're doing, regardless of, of your nine of cups, regardless of you being the sun, the chariot, the, the ace of pentacles, the ace of swords, the king of cups, the lovers, the higher fun, regardless of you being knowledgeable and wise in the star. Regardless of this of this cycle coming to an end, Sagittarius, there are going to be things that you cannot control. And you're laying that burden down of worrying about what other people think of you. 
So who's ever sending you the evil eye, who's, who's, whoever is sending you negative energy, they're in for a rude awakening because Sagittarius, you're letting that go. It's out of your control. Tell me more about, oops, the queen of wands. Look at that. Because you are the queen of wands. You're showing up as yourself, Sagittarius. It's like, oops, my bad. I didn't, I didn't know. I didn't know uh Sagittarius was 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 being real. I didn't I didn't know that the Sagittarius is a queen or king. I've given the evil eye to the to the to the queen. The king. Tell me more about obstacles. Like I said, this could have been an obstacle for you. You could have heard things about yourself through the grapevine. You're like, really? Some some type of rumors here. You let it go. Oh, look at that. The ace of wands. You let it go. Look at all these wands coming out. You're, you're here, Sagittarius. You're here. You are here, Sagittarius. You're coming out. You're letting this go. You are the Ace of Wands. You are the Ace of Swords. You are the Ace of Pentacles. Oh, my goodness, Sagittarius. Oh, my goodness. This is beautiful. Tell me more about this mistress. Because I feel like with this mistress card, you are a mystery. And you don't care about being a mystery anymore. You're, this is who you are. Look at all of these ones. Look at all of this fire. You can't help that you're mysterious, Sagittarius. You cannot help that that there are people who want to put labels on you. Labels that don't belong to you, Sagittarius. Tell me more about mistress. Justice. Oh, I mean, Sagittarius, you're you're letting it go. You're you're balancing out the scales, baby. You're balancing out the scales. It, it is not, this is not your concern. This evil eye, it's not your concern. Let's dive a little deeper, Sagittarius. Tell me more about the Ten of Wands with the evil eye. This is not your burden, Sagittarius, and you know this. That's why you're sitting on this throne with your Ace of Wands and Justice. Like, it's, it's nothing that you can do about this situation except be, and that's what you're doing. The King of Pentacles. It's about your stability. Carrying, carrying this load, Sagittarius, has, has affected your stability. So you're laying down the wands, Sagittarius. You don't have to carry all of these wands when you're the queen, when you're the ace. You don't need all of you don't you don't need to carry all of that. You you've done that already, Sagittarius. You're going into a new cycle with the world. Something has ended. This cycle of, of you of you trying to protect yourself from the evil eye has ended you're in a season of, of worrying about who you are and what you can control and you cannot control everything Sagittarius but someone gave the evil eye to the queen the king and they didn't realize that but it's, it's being revealed with the sun just how you show up in your community how you're showing up for others wow and how how others show up for you Sagittarius tell me more about the queen of wands with oops the Five of Cups. <laughs> Someone underestimated you, Sagittarius. Someone was so wrong about you, Sagittarius. And you're like, okay, be wrong about me. But they realize this now. Whoever sent the negative energy your way, it's like it's it's having to come back around to them because they were sending they were sending negative energy to to someone who's upright. They were sending negative energy to someone who's an inspiration to people who are down here with the five of cups. Wow, Sagittarius. Tell me more about this ace of wands with obstacles. This was a major obstacle for you that you've overcome. This was mental and emotional emotional. Tell me more about this Ace of Wands with obstacles. Look at that. You were wore, you were wore out worrying about a situation that you could that you could not control. This situation that you could not control. You can't make someone see the best in you, Sagittarius. You cannot make someone see the best in you, Sagittarius. You just have to be. Tell me more about justice with the mistress. You are allowing yourself to be a mystery, and you feel like, hey, it's okay. It's okay. I don't have to go out of my way to, to explain myself because I'm getting justice in this season. My justice is me showing up as myself in my wands energy. You could be connected to a Libra. Look at that. 
This is not your fight. You're getting justice for an imbalance. You're getting justice for rumors. You have hidden enemies, Sagittarius. You have, you have those who have preyed upon your downfall, Sagittarius. Yes, you have. And that's why it's here. That's why it's a mystery. This is even a mystery to you. You have those who have slandered your name, Sagittarius, and they didn't even know you for real. They didn't know you for real. And to be quite honest, most, most of these people didn't even know any better. They didn't know any better. So, so not only are you getting justice, Sagittarius, you're you're moving forward with this chariot energy. You're in the energy of 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 love with the lovers with the sun. You're in the energy of forgiveness. And that's what that's what makes this so beautiful. You're in the energy of forgiveness, Sagittarius. I'm gonna pull some more energy for you before we end this reading. Thank y'all so much. I hope you all are enjoying this reading. What an amazing reading, Sagittarius. What an amazing reading. You have fighting. Look at that. Look at that. You have fighting here. Justice again. Look at that. Oh my goodness, Sagittarius. It's here. It's here. The justice is here. You don't have to fight battles that don't belong to you. And you realize that major, major growth, Sagittarius, Scorpio energy. This could have been hidden from you. You could have felt like for the longest you have to speak up for yourself and, and, and prove to people about who you are. No, you're a mystery and that's okay. You, it's okay to be a mystery, Sagittarius. And you realize that. You realize it's okay to not explain yourself. You don't have to, Sagittarius. You don't have to explain yourself. You have Aquarius. Look at that about the, about the star. So you definitely could be connected to a uh, Libra, Gemini, Aquarius, Scorpio, Pisces, Cancer. Let's clarify. You have fighting, but it's clear to see here. It's clear to see what's going on here. Sagittarius. Tell me more about fighting. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. You have the Knight of Wands. Oh, look at that. The five of cups for justice. <laughs> oh, my goodness. You're getting your justice, Sagittarius, for this five of cups. Someone underestimated made it, made it you. Someone prejudged you, Sagittarius, here. It was so unfair. That's why you're getting justice for this imbalance. You've had hidden enemies. You've had, you have, you've had, ha you have had those to slander your name. Look at all these ones here. Look at, look at all of your energy showing up. Sagittarius, tell me more about Scorpio. Give me more for Scorpio. The three of wands. So you 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 could have collaborated with someone. You could be collabor collaborating with someone. You may not see this coming. You may not see this coming. This could be unexpected. This could be an opportunity. Tell me more about Aquarius. The will of fortune. Look at that. Oh my goodness, Sagittarius. This could definitely be unexpected for you. Some type of collaboration could be unexpected. Possibly with, with an air sign. Or someone who's very intellectual. Wow, this could be out of the blue. This could be something, cre a creative project. Tell me more about fighting with the Knight of Wands. Oh, <laughs> you have the Eight of Wands. Tell me more about justice with the Five of Cups. You're getting justice for this Five of Cups, Sagittarius. This is coming to an end for you. You have the Knight of Swords. <laughs> Look at that. <laughs> wow, oh my goodness. Sagittarius, you're definitely getting justice for this situation. This could have felt like it, it took a long time for you to get this justice, for you to finally get relief from this situation. You're finally getting relief. It's like you're looking forward. You're looking. You're looking to a more positive, positive direction. You're moving in a in a positive direction. You're done fighting this battle. You don't even have to fight this battle. Tell me more about the three of wands with Scorpio. Oh, look at that. The moon. Oh, this could definitely be something unexpected, something that's hidden from you. You have some type of collaboration here. Some type of opportunity, I feel, with this Wheel of Fortune here. Some type of opportunity is coming in for you. Tell me more about Aquarius with the Wheel of Fortune. The Two of Wands. Oh, some type of connection here, Sagittarius. This could be a love connection. This could be, this could be a new beginning for you and someone with the world. Something, something, something is ending and a new cycle has begun. And it's time for you to put, put in the effort. 
I'm getting put in the effort, Sagittarius. Pull a love oracle for you. What does Sagittarius need to know about their love life at this time? You have date. Meeting someone new, dating, get back out there. Plan, set a date. I feel like a lot of you have set a date. I do. I feel like a lot of you have set a date and you're moving in a direction that is going to allow you to, to have good experiences in love here with the lovers and the sun. A lot of you are in a very passionate, romantic connection. You have love call. Someone expresses love, a message of love, thinking of you and letting you know. I do feel like someone is expressing their self to you, especially with this Aquarius energy here. This is a strong expression. This person is very confident in, in, what, in what they're saying. You have heartbroken, deeply hurt, sad, separation, breakup, feeling lost, grieving, mourning. I feel like a lot of you have been in this Five of Cups energy. A lot of you could have been in a negative energy regarding your love life. Because someone clearly broke your heart here. Someone underestimated you. Someone put the queen in, in Five of Cups energy. Let me pull, let me pull a couple more energy, energy cards for you, Sagittarius, before we end this reading. You have envy. Yeah. You have crybaby. <laughs> you have the five of cups here twice. And I feel like a lot of you are done crying. Someone could be crying because you're leaving them behind. And you're you're having this, this new beginning. But these tears is not are not like tears of like it's it's not something you would laugh at. You know, you don't want to laugh at someone crying, but at the same time, it's like it's like this person is like, oops, like, you know, I give I've given Sagittarius the evil eye. So, so now, even, even, even if this person isn't physically crying, this person has lost something, something valuable, like a piece of you. Someone lost a piece of you, Sagittarius. Someone lost a piece of you. Tell me your secrets. Look at all this Scorpio energy. Tell me, tell me more about envy. Look at that strength. Someone is very envious of you, Sagittarius. They could be envious of your love life. They could be envious of your friend circle, of the support that you get with this Leo energy. They're envious of the sun. You have the sun here three times. Very envious. A, a lot of you can, can, sense, can sense this envy. I feel like someone is turning their nose up at you like when they see you, Sagittarius. Someone is turning their nose up at you. I'm getting that very strongly. Look at that. The lovers. Someone is turning their nose up at you and your lover. Look at that. The lovers twice. Like someone is someone is not happy that that you're you're being loved. That you're loving and also being loved in return. Someone is not okay with this. Sagittarius, and this is really not your concern. <laughs> it's really not your concern. Tell me more about uh, Crybaby. Look at that. The Ace of Cups. I mean, tears are flowing. A lot of you could be crying because of your happiness. You have the Ace of Cups. Oh my goodness, beautiful. You have all the Aces here. So much opportunity for you. A lot of you, a lot of you are crying because you feel so free. You're you're crying, happy tears. Wow, you're crying happy tears because you're able to move forward in the situation. Tell me more about Tell Me Your Secrets. You have the Seven of Wands. <laughs> oh my goodness. You have the Seven of Wands again for Tell Me Your Secrets. Look at this. You're getting justice for this imbalance. I'm telling you, Sagittarius, you, you're getting justice for this imbalance. You're getting justice for being prejudged. You're getting justice for that. Someone could have told your secrets and you could be getting justice for this. Someone could have could have spread, spread rumors about you. Someone could have 
shared some private information about you with someone else, Sagittarius. This could have brought about a lot of imbalance in your life. And even if it didn't bring balance balance to you directly, Sagittarius, you, you felt the negative energy. You felt the need to protect your energy. Look at that. And you have the fool. You felt the need to protect your energy, Sagittarius. Look at that. And you got the emperor coming out. Let's clarify. Tell me more about strength with the lovers and envy. Man, someone is upset that you are being loved. Someone is upset that you're being loved. You could you could have a partner or someone who is, is romantically attracted to you. And this person, someone else could, could see this person as some, someone who kisses the ground that you walk on. But it's not that. It's just that this person is also a lover. The person that you love is also a lover, Sagittarius. And everyone doesn't like this. Tell me more about this situation. You have the seven of pentacles. Someone wants to have a piece of what you're experiencing, Sagittarius. Someone wants to have a piece of that for themselves. Give me one more. Look at that. Someone wants to join you. Someone wishes that wishes that they can experience what you're experiencing, Sagittarius. Tell me more about Crybaby with the Ace of Cups. A lot of you are having an over, overflow of emotions because you feel free from a situation you feel like you're getting justice in a situation finally it's here finally you're able to to have some type of relief you're releasing something you've released something the ace of pentacles oh my look at that <laughs> you're 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 being gifted and you're being given a lot sagittarius give me one more the king of cups. Someone loves you so much. Someone could cry when they think of you. Their eyes water when they think of you, Sagittarius. Oh, I mean, this is why some someone is very envious. Someone is very envious of this. Someone is making you cry happy tears. And this brings some type of envy into, into your energy. So stay protected, Sagittarius. It's not really your concern. It's not really your concern. <laughs> tell me more about, tell me your secrets with the seven of wands. The king of swords. Yeah, someone said something that caused an imbalance. And that's why you're getting justice for this situation. The truth is being revealed, Sagittarius. Sagittarius, thank you so much for tuning in to this reading. This is the Sagittarian goddess. And I will see you all in the next reading.